What's up guys on YouTube? Uh, this is Texan with Bass 8 and uh, I was going to give you a little tip on how to store your soft plastic baits. Get a little selfie with the boat here. She's a beaut. Alright, so I've looked on YouTube um, on how to like store soft plastic baits and it's come up with mainly two solutions. It's either one, people want to keep them in boxes. Um, or the other way is through binder sleeves with uh, binders. I've done both of those ways over the years. Uh, and I haven't really liked either one of them. So I really, I really don't like storing them in boxes just because they can lose their shape and they get heated up and they'll melt and they get all sticky in your trays and it's a pain in the butt to clean out. So... I don't like doing that period and plus I like keeping them in the bags that they come in because a lot of them have scents and oils that uh, come on the baits from the manufacturer and I don't like to take them out of the box because then those dry up and and they're just plain old plastic after that so um, I don't I also don't like to use the binder sleeves just because they're made out of like cheap Ziploc type material. They got the seals and they break down over time. Um, they're thin bags. They can get poked. And even the ones that have like the tracks on them, like the Ziploc track deal, those break. And it's just. Plus, I don't want to have to zip and unzip a binder when I'm looking for soft plastic baits. And so I've come up kind of with my own idea, and it's kind of more towards the um, bait binder type deal, but it's it's not. It's a little bit different, and it's a little bit more heavy duty, in my opinion. Um, I'm not really all that much. It's pretty waterproof. Uh, it's pretty, and it's real tough. It should resist dirt and everything just fine. Um, so here it is that I've come up with. And all it is, guys, is um, I went out to Walmart. And I got these uh, pencil, they're like pencil pouches for binders, three ring binders. And they're 97 cents a piece. And what I like about these is it's heavy duty nylon. It's gonna last you a lifetime. It's not gonna break down on you like the plastic. And it has this nice clear, heavy duty plastic clear window where I can see what bait that I'm using. Um, and all I did was was get I got eight of these um, Probably about to go back and get a lot more of them And then I had some black zip ties lying around and all I did is ran it through all these holes and Cinched it up down then cinched it up real tight just loose enough where I could these flip open easily and um, So yeah, then there and I just throw that down in my hatch and it works amazing and it's I can flip right through all of them super easy easy to see way tougher than a bait regular bait binder um, doesn't have a cover on it so I'm not having to zip it and unzip it it's just right there and it fits perfectly down in my hatch and you can fit anything from a regular size uh, bait package like these Havoc Pit Bosses all the way up to a 10 inch uh, thumper and they'll fit in here just fine. So you're not having to get different size bags either. They all fit in here. Uh, the only thing that I th could think of off the top of my head that might not fit in here would be like a man's jelly, big jelly worm, you know, 16, 17 inch jelly worm. That might not fit. But other than that, fits like everything else. Um, I hope this helps. Uh, like, subscribe to my channel. Uh, thank you guys. Thank you.